yeah exactly that's true you cannot be fluent by watching youtube videos and i know what i'm saying i know what you may be thinking like but this is also a youtube channel we are watching you well just watch my video till end and you will understand most of the english learners are making this mistake see here what i want to say is knowledge will not make you fluent but your behavior will i will prove you i will tell you i'll explain you with the help of a story which happened in my institute actually i had two students one is rajiv another is ahmed i will tell their stories and you will understand exactly what mistake most of you are doing by watching youtube videos okay stay tuned stay till the end a very important video and i think you also are doing the same mistake which 95% of the students are doing don't do this mistake stay till the end and you will understand what exactly is going wrong here okay now friends see here let me explain you this with the help of a story let's and these are real people name is changed but these people were in my institute in my online sessions one was rajiv now see how was rajiv's attitude how was his th way of thinking and i will tell about ahmed also and then you can decide in which category you come in rajiv he was a mba from pune he was uh, searching for jobs actually he was a fresher and what he was doing was this see here he was focusing on gaining more knowledge he was just focusing on knowledge i'm talking about english knowledge he was watching videos after videos about how to uh, use this word what are the different type of uh, idioms uh, how to use uh, would could should um, how to use new words or there are some videos like don't use this word use this word all these kind of videos he was watching he told me all these things so he was more interested in gaining knowledge so he was whole day busy in that he was focusing on perfection than execution his thinking was this he was telling me that sir before going to interview my english must be perfect but then only i will go in interview if i make a mistake it's horrible huh? so his focus was on perfection rather than execution means he was not focusing on delivering his message in the interview he was only focusing on his english his accuracy his perfection this was his attitude next he was focusing on new and difficult words and sentences there was something in his mind that i should use some new words to impress the hr some difficult sentences which are difficult to understand some like esoteric words i mean some very very native like natural very natural like i should sound like a native speaker and i will go and impress the hr that was his, was his thinking next one this was the problem he was watching because of this he was watching 2 to 4 hours of different youtube videos he was watching just now i said to you that his focus was to gain the knowledge and his main source of gaining the knowledge was watching variety of youtube videos 2 to 4 hours he told me 2 to 4 hours he would watch all the videos different type of trainers different type of methods all the sentence structures all the grammar all different variety he had a full notebook he would write all the things full notebook was full only 10 to 15 minutes he'd give to speak that means his behavior his speaking was only 10 to 15 minutes but most of the time this much 2 to 4 hours was going in learning only learning and gaining and acquiring the knowledge so overall his equation was 90% of his time would go on youtube and 10% on behavior well as i said in the first slide that sorry let me come here as i said in the first slide that knowledge will not make you fluent it is the behavior and let me take to the third slide this is about ahmed this guy was really amazing his education was not too much i mean he was only 12th he was from kerala and he is in touch with me even today also now see his attitude his way of thinking hmm? focus on gaining more experience his focus was just gain more experience than gaining more knowledge he was focusing on more on just knowledge i mean he was not like uh, only acquire grab the knowledge 
Now, his focus was gaining more experience. He wanted to gain experience and experience can be gained by action, by participation, by doing. So that was his focus. Next one. His focus was on expression than perfection. He was only, he was in sales actually. And his focus was to convince his clients, his customers about his product. He was working in a construction industry. And his focus was that, how can I convince this customer about my product? He was not for focusing on using perfect exact English words. Never like that. He was just expressing himself. Very easy going and very natural English he was speaking. His focus was on using familiar and simple words. He was never into impressing the customers. His main goal was to touch them emotionally, to help them understand his product, to help them understand why his product is better than others. His focus was only to convey his message. And for that, he was using just simple words. Whatever the words he knew, he was comfortable with. This is very important. He was using that. Okay. Now you can see here two to three hours of attention for attending coordinator session. What is coordinator session? If you don't know, in our online sessions, we have one very unique way of developing your confidence called the coordinator session. This session is, it, this opens at eight o'clock in the morning and closes at 11 o'clock at night. Every one hour different session is there. Our coordinators are there. And these are the same coordinators who are our students actually. Now, what happens these coordinators are programmed psychologically through our training in the first month they are programmed and then they become coordinators. This guy, Ahmed, was regularly joining there. I'd say that because we monitor it very closely. More time on coordinator session, more time into speaking, more time into action, more time into behavior. Only 10 to 15 minutes on YouTube. Only 10 to 15 minutes. See ya, come here back. Here, this guy was only 10 to 15 minutes on speaking, two to four hours on YouTube. Come here, exactly opposite. Exactly opposite. Now, overall, his equation was in this way, 90% behavior, 10% English micro habits. These are some different habits which uh, we, I, I always give to my students, English micro habits, but his focus was on behavior. Now, he was more, mostly focusing on behavior because the reason, I'll tell you, we, we program our students psychologically before they go in the coordinator's batch. Therefore, they start communicating without doing all what this student did, Rajiv. Of course, he changed afterwards. Now, let us move forward and understand why this happens. This is very important. Why we do this? Because mostly, maybe you are also, I, I, I said like, you may be also doing the same thing, like whole day watching one video after another video. Uh, this trainer is saying that do this. This training is saying that do the pronunciation in this way. This trainer is saying that use this book. This trainer is saying that use this all the grammar and you will be perfect. Uh, one video I have seen that that uh, title was oh, 100 sentences by heart the man you will be fooled. So he was watching all the variety, all confusion was there. Why? Academic influence is there. Because in academics, we believe that theory, first theory, because that's true in academics. We would always do theory and then we would go for practicals, like physics, chemistry, biology. First the theory and afterwards the practical. And theory was having more importance, as you know, theory uh, 80 and remaining 20% practicals. So this is the influence which we have. And the problem is, this is not going to work in language. Language doesn't work in this way. Theoretically or having a lot of knowledge about language will not make you fluent. You have to actually gain the knowledge while speaking. See, listen, knowledge of a language is actually acquired while speaking. When you speak and when you listen to someone, the language is, that knowledge is acquired. Most of us are wasting two to three hours only watching videos and getting the knowledge. That knowledge is of no use. Because we are focusing on academic methods. It's not going to help you. Next one, habit of doing easy things. See, understand that watching a three and four hour of YouTube video will not make you nervous. It's very comfortable. I mean, you don't need much efforts and you, you are not required to go through some stress and nervousness. No, it's easy. Just watch the video. But when you are going and participating in our coordinator session where 10, 20 students are in front of you, we make them speak. We make them 
deliver a talk, we make them give a presentation, you get butterflies in your stomach. And that is what we do. Hey, my important line. If you want to be good communicator, you have to disturb yourself emotionally. Nervousness will be there, stress, anxiety, all these things will come. Only then you can be a better communicator and that is what we do. And what do we do is usually we want to do easy things. Therefore, we are wasting our time watching YouTube videos two to three hours. In the comment, I want you to write how many hours you watch such videos and how many hours you actually behave. What is your ratio? Two to three hours of YouTube and five to ten minutes of speaking? Well, you are doomed for failure. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. So finally, what is the solution? Obvious. Stop YouTube and start getting into action. Well, you may say that, but Sandeep, we do not have that surrounding. You say that, you know, speak. Oh, well, you, you, I, I don't have any answer, but we have an amazing platform. But if I say that, join our institute, you will feel like he's marketing his institute. Well, I, we have an amazing online platform where students from eight countries are there and all over India. Students are there. It's a family. Everyone is just like enjoying each and every moment there. Morning 8 o'clock, 11 o'clock at night, these sessions are going on. You will get an amazing platform. And this is the reason why my students are confident speakers. Because we don't feed them knowledge. We make them do behavior and action. Hope, friends, you liked it. And you really have got this very important video, important thing about communication. Take care and work on yourself. Bye-bye.